Now we mentioned that a data engineer is basically going to take all the data from data sources and move it into data, a data analytics platform. But what kind of things are inside of that data analytics platform? Well, one of those things is a data warehouse. Okay, so essentially a data warehouse is a database for analytics. Okay, in the same way that a database sort of abstracts all the different layers of dealing with data as far as how the data is stored, how do we track tables, how do we track multiple tables, how do we execute queries, all that's sort of abstracted across one piece of software that just kind of handles all that behind the scenes, and we just kind of send it questions, give it data, etc. A data warehouse does that, but specifically for analytics and is optimized for sort of analytical type workloads. So the life of a data engineer when a data warehouse is involved can look very much like you're taking data sources and you're gonna create those ETL pipelines to land them in a data warehouse, which again is combining the concept of how to store the data. So it's a separate place to store data physically and a separate thing that's gonna provide the computational power to then run analytics on that also referred to as compute. So whenever I say storage, it means where's the data physically stored. Whenever I say compute, it just means like the software that's running, that's actually processing the queries, whether they're written in Python or SQL, who's running that code. Okay, that's the compute. Okay, so the data warehouse generally provides you both. And very popular warehouses include Snowflake, AWS Redshift, Microsoft Synapse, Google BitQuery. But oftentimes, this is a big part. Generally, these data warehouses focuses primarily on structured data. So this is leave a problem. How do we handle unhandled? How do we handle unstructured data and other sort of edge cases? Do we really want to put all of our data in the data warehouse? Because oftentimes that can get pretty expensive. So there are going to be other pieces to an analytics platform that's going to allow this to kind of all work together. But we'll get into that very soon. But now you know what a data warehouse is. I'll, I'll see you in the next one.